spider in. All right, we're back. And we're going up on top of this building and we're gonna execute our excellent plan or whatever MJ has planned. I'm in. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Yeah. Yeah, let me know if you get in trouble. I knew you were trouble when you walked in. Shame on me, yeah, yeah, And you're lying on the cold, hard ground. Ah! Thanks, Pete. Ah! Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. That would help. Next election will get destroyed. Cockroach in a starched suit. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Yeah, rile them up. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. <sighs> Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. <laughs> uh, MJ. You Never change. Left my animal. stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. <laughs> that should do it. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember. Yeah. Hello. Oh, a taser. I know a few sable agents who would love to meet you. Brilliant. Love it. Watch your sixes, man. Oh, a stealth takedown. MJ's got a gun. Granted, it's a stun gun, but. Still. I like this thing. <laughs> yeah, we figured you would. Gotta turn him around. Huh? Who's there? Wow. Good boy. Good boy. Turn! I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room next to the Sable agent. Only one agent? Oh no, whatever will we do? Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out. And the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Yeah. Meanwhile, the stable agents are still on the ground. Right? Yeah, he's over there just hanging out. He's Jay chilling. Nobody will see me exit the security room for sure. And security's just gone. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Oh, they're just gone. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Could really use a coffee. Let's go slide into that elevator. Stupid useless button. Oh, Sable knows. Maybe not. 
All right then. Cool, cool, cool. It's just that easy to get into a penthouse. We're in. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. <laughs> Weirder still that no MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? It's a little helmet. Whoa, what? this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? That's what it looks like. Where it leads. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Hmm. I got something. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to the secret keypad behind the family portrait? Norman must like spy movies. <laughs> we need to find the code for that keypad. Need to find the code. A code. A code. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? <laughs> That's a good question. The answer still is no one. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Must be the day Harry left for Europe. Brilliant. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in Bello. Peace in War. <laughs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? But where? But why? This but how? smells like rich people. <laughs> Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Probably. Things rich people have. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um,. On a big trip. Uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Gotta get in his room first. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. That is the question. God, 
Beat and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. <laughs> Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Yeah, you telling him, Jay. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Yep, that's how it goes. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? I wonder. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. <laughs> and he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? Ooh. Not just mayor of New York, mayor of the world. Happy birthday, dear. Sorry I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Apparently a lot. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Yep. Yeah. That'll do it. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. These days as children go away so quickly before you know it. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. <laughs> yes, because the penthouse wasn't enough by itself. I'm so bad at this. I can't find what I'm looking for. Why am I so incredibly bad at this? I assume I'm looking for a picture of the mom because it said it was with you. assume that's what I'm looking for but oh my gosh I can't find anything there we go there's a tiny little picture in the corner Harry's mom Emily we used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown but he might have been right feels <sighs> like there's something attached to the back of the frame what a key score this must be the key for Harry's room that it would be that it would be Let's go prop that door open. What? 
This can't be for Harry, can it? I mean, it sounds like he was sick, so... Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? There's his journal. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. Leaving for Europe that today. That must be the code to huh. that room. Not sure how it's gonna go. Dad says there's no risk, but that's Dad. Dr. Michael thinks it's more like 50-50. So, okay, I might not make it. If that happens, I bet you'll be reading this, Dad. Who am I kidding? You're probably reading it anyway. Norman always has to know. So if you are reading this, Dad, and if no risk at all it turns out to be another Osborne campaign promise, then do me a favor. Show this next part to Pete and MJ. Just them. Please. Thanks, Dad. I love you. To Peter Parker and Mary Jane Watson. Guys, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. If you're reading this, man, this is tough. Even an imagined hypothetical letter to you, it's hard to be honest. Here goes. I'm sick. Like, really sick. Doctor thinks it's the same thing my mom had. Neurodegeneration. Rapid onset. I've known for a while, but thought I could manage it. I didn't tell you because... Well, because I didn't tell you. I was worried how you'd react. I couldn't stand to see you go through what I did with my mom, watching her suffer. And like I couldn't help. Watching her die was worse than the dying. Things got really bad recently. All those times I was wiped out from partying or just super busy. Not partying. Not busy. Sick. This Europe trip, well, it's a cover-up. I'm going in for treatment. Experimental, long-term. Dad's been working on it forever. Promises it'll work. He hates the nickname the texts have for it. Devil's Breath. Says it makes something good seem scary, but maybe Devil's Breath is what I need. A little bit of bad to do a lot of good. Okay. Dad's here. Time to go. And they're back. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready. And I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Oh, Keep Sable. Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Oh, poor Sable. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Alpha Chief, stay alert. I should still have the stun gun. Wasn't 100% sure, but I thought I should still have it. Got him. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Bingo. Here we are. Oh my. Super creepy. Gotta find yeah. the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. That he does. That he does. Wow. 
Norman wins the fancy map contest. <laughs> Looks like the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's pro commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on disabled troop deployments. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's... No. Norman's not crazy. A records facility could be perfect cover for the de good old Alpha team. Nope. That's just a sable patrol. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big sable present. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. That's it. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. Wow. Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? Definitely Martin. And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. Yeah, let the medicine work. Lee. I, I have to get this. What? Spooter. No. Oh, now you've done Who's it, MJ. There? We have a breach. High alert. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Pete, I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Dang it. Wait. Dang it. I guess a lot of shooting a guy in the middle of a broad daylight wasn't the smartest option. I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? I guess it wasn't Two the smartest thing I've done. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Better check it out, he says. Better check it out. I'm sure that's going to work wonders for you. He's 
these guards stink at their job. Like really super mega stink at their job. Man down. Control, send back up. Like really stink at their job. Who's there? Eyes open. Spider Man's here. Spider Man. How dare you? Sable's the one in charge. You ready? Wait, wait, hold on. It's too late. You're up. Oh my. <laughs> you are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh. My gosh. Just jumps off a building. That's the way it goes, I guess. And we're back home. Good for you. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick? Norman and Lee? And Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. I mean, the. Whoa, no. No, not this song again. I was gonna say, you're entirely. You are not alone anymore, down. Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You. You find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. <laughs> Well, that was slightly awkward, but it's all right. Oh, the spider. 42. What does that mean? What could it mean? Melee damage increased. That's get that anti serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Lee and Otto. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. <laughs> they can and they will. Okay. Norman's on his way to get the anti serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. It is. Oscorp just created an anti serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's really? helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This will all be over soon. I promise. Wow. It all happens so very quickly. And we're gonna have to wait to see the conclusion of this fiasco. We're getting close to the end, I know that, but we're not quite there yet. So we're gonna climb the top of this mountain, top square, mountain, top of the city, top of the building. My gosh, is it a mountain? That meme with the guy in the butterfly. Is this a mountain? And it's just me holding a skyscraper. Is this a mountain? Ah, can it, Jameson? 